And we're back with some more thumper action. Hello. We're gonna be, once I don't press the fucking B button. Uh, oh, what a good start. Raul at his finest. Oh my God, what am I doing? So we were talking about ah. primate. And how much <laughs> of a badass he is. Yes, we were. <laughs> So these are his um, his descriptions. This is why I really like him because he is just a a crazy like this is what a Pokemon should be. So in this is all his Pokedex entries, and it, this has literally got all of them. So I'm only going to read it to you. Um, in red and blue, it says always furious and tenacious to boot. It will not abandon chasing its quarry until it is caught. Damn. Um, Non-stop killer right there. So well, that's what that's telling me. It stops being angry only when nobody else is around. To view this moment is very difficult. It becomes wildly furious if it even senses someone looking at it. It chases anyone that meets its glare. It will beat up anyone who is who makes it mad, even if it has to chase them until the end of the world. Oh my god! That, that is that? badass. That is that's Jamie. It's, it's kind of me. <laughs> when it becomes furious, its blood circulation becomes more robust. Its muscles are made stronger, but it also becomes much less, <laughs> mus, much less intelligent. <laughs> I think that makes sense. Oh my god, get fucked. If approached while sleeping, it may awaken and angrily give chase in a groggy state of semi-sleep. <laughs> I think I've experienced that while I was Jamie's roommate. You would have, yeah. <laughs> Please disregard the me dying often and a lot. Meanwhile, we explain primates. And the two, the two best ones that oh. made me really like it. Um, it has been known to become so angry that it dies as a result. <laughs> its face looks peaceful in death, however. Oh. So it finally gets peace. Oh shit! It's awesome. <laughs> that's fucking. And that's fucking crazy. Some researchers theorize that Primate remains angry even when inside its Pokeball. That's hilarious. That makes sense. He is just absolutely mad at everything. <laughs> Wait, what is inside of a Pokeball? Well, nothing that's going to make Primate happy. <laughs> You're right. So what, what else does it matter? I like to think it's kind of like a... If you went to a really nice spa or something and there's like a, you know, a mud tub. Yeah. <laughs> Have you been inside of a mud tub? No. <laughs> Is it even good? Probably not. I don't know. If you've been inside a mud tub, let us know what it's like down in the comments there. <laughs> See, like, I, I, it definitely has to, like, pertain to the Pokemon, I think, too. Like, not every Pokemon's gonna like himself a little mud tub in there. Like, if you're Charmander, you're not gonna go into fucking mud. What about Diglett? Oh, he's, 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 he brings his own mud. He comes with mud. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Yeah, so that's why I like him. What was yours? Yours is Terracraft. Oh, dude, Heracraft, yeah. Let's see what he's got. Oh, he's just a fucking... He's, oh, he's the best. I'm excited for this. Episode. Oh, shit. Ow. Fucking Heracross became my favorite Pokemon from the fucking Pokemon TV show. Because Ash's hair cross was hilarious. He, uh, what is it called? He would eat the sap out of Bulbasaur's uh, bulb, which I thought was just so funny. <laughs> and then ever since then, and, and then he has a couple of like really awesome fights in the anime. So I was just like, yep, he's my favorite. And there you go. And you don't have one. Yeah. In Pokemon Go, I have a fucking badass That's one. Yeah. Normal. So what does it say? I'm looking for it. Where is it? Jeez. I'm almost at the boss, dude. Hell yeah. It's about time. It's about time. <laughs> Alright, what what's it got? Go? I feel like I've gone to a different thing here. One Pokedex day. Pokedex entries, okay. This powerful Pokemon thrusts its prized horn under its enemies. Bellies then. What? Bellies then lifts and throws them? Yeah, uh, under his, but like, the uh, opponent's Pokemon belly, so like, un on the underside. Usually docile, but if disturbed while sipping honey, it chases off its intruder with its horn. 
So don't fuck with the See, sun. Like, that speaks to me. It's like, don't fuck with me and I'm totally chill. And then, you know. Don't fuck with Raul's honey. You, you've seen Angry Raul once. One time. <laughs> it was hilarious. Technical difficulties one more time, but we are back. Should we do something funny every time something takes flight? Let us know in the comments ah! if we should do something funny. <laughs> You're fucking... And leave oh, the... Oh, uh... god damn it! God, Raul sucks at I this need, game. I need to... I... I wonder... I wonder... Would Jamie be good at this game? Rhythm violence? Hell yeah. <laughs> Do you usually perform <laughs> violence rhythmically? Yeah. No, Ooh, no, no better I way. got that the fuck down. No Not better way part. to strike an opponent than to a beat. <laughs> you should know I'll that. I'll get fucked. It's always the same stupid shit. You should know that <laughs> listening to trap music. <laughs> <laughs> it's not what you think it is, darling. <laughs> so those who may have missed it, Raul is um, the world's newest trap fan. Loves, I don't know. Oh my What do trap people do? Do you wear like the glow sticks and stuff? No, I don't think that. Dude, I, I don't fucking know. I literally just found out about the diamond. I feel like it's a mix of goth and <laughs> techno. Why? Why would that be the case? I don't know. It just, that's so just that's what, what the name evokes? Done. Yep. This is essentially a mix of goth and rave. <laughs> like, look at the dark art and everything. It's got something going on. Oh, is it boss fight time? Oh no, I just, I just wanted to change up. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to pay attention there. There, there it is. There it is. Here we oh, go. Yes! There we go. Dude, the, the tunnels always freak me out. Because I know I'm going to fuck it up. Ooh! Damn. Fucking killing it. Damn. Damn. Dude, did you ever play DDR? Dance Dance Revolution. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know. Oh, why not? Be like, at least once? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm sure I did. Okay. Yeah. Oh, dude, that. I didn't get into it, though. Like, it wasn't a, it wasn't a thing that I needed to do every day. <laughs> when I was in high school. Of course. Mm -hmm. Right when you did your Sweet 16 episode? Uh, I'd say a little couple more years after. After? Uh, Ooh, oh, yeah. You just moved up. Oh yeah, dude. You just kept moving Sweet, up in the Sweet world. Sweet 16 was the beginning of my adventures. <laughs> 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 that legitimately was when I was like, I got a little bit more. Anyway. <laughs> a little You're bit in more. the spotlight. You got to taste the spotlight. Basically. You, could, you couldn't leave. And then I became friends with the world, baby. Uh, <laughs> what was I saying? Fuck, DDR. I had a, a friend who was super into it. Like, dude, we would go to the arcade, and I fucking hated it, so I didn't want to play it. But right. he would just fucking get down. Like, he was one of those guys that, like, held that, like held on to the little back bar, mm -hmm. and just, like, his feet, they were just like, uh... Did you ever, you, you've seen the Harry Potter movies. Yeah. Yeah. You know when Ron, like, finds, like, that spider, and then he puts skates on it? Yep. And how it's just, like, scrambling around? Mm hmm It's like that. Okay. That's what his feet look like. Just, okay. like... Like a tornado. Basically. Like he looked like Sonic. He looked, he looked like, like Sonic. Sonic. There it is. So it forever is. spinning. <laughs> ah! This is a long level. They've definitely upped the, uh, the gameplay. Something. I hate the tunnel, dude. Fuck. I feel like I have to like get everything right for me to move on to the next step. That's why it's like taking so long. Takes a while. It's possible. I haven't really explained much about Thumper. Oh no, wait, there it is. There's the ending. <laughs> Got him! Dude, back in the tunnel. <laughs> tunnel These walls like make the the grinding walls blend in. So, what do you mean? 
Oh, the, yeah, you see that? the tunnel walls. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a challenge. It's a challenge. Ugh. It's like they wanted to make it a bit harder every level you get. Yes! Just concentration. Yes. Boom! What level Fuck is yeah. this now? You're at like Who the hell knows? 24? <laughs> I'm just going with the flow, baby. Just like MB. Me and MB. We're in sync. We are one. I have become a metal bug. So you've a hundred... Oh, oh, you don't look that in sync. You just lost your wings. I let go. Damn. I let go of the damn control stick. All right. This is level three, number 24. Dude, me and MD are back in sync, baby. Here it is. <laughs> I just, just jinxed the fuck out of myself. But you don't believe in jinxes. See, I know I didn't until you, until you fucking made me believe. I mean, I can believe. You don't have to believe. That's like, that's the beauty of yes. being yourself. But like, I like straight up jinxed you when I shouldn't have. You did. I forgot what I did though, but I did. So did I. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come on. Dead. I love those little parts. Oh, I just noticed something. Whenever I do that big fly, like where I fly, he actually flies a little bit and then lands, mm -hmm. it actually makes those little tendrils on the sides go away. Which is interesting. The little. Tendrils? What, the barriers or whatever? No, the the little fucking floating things in the background. Watch. See that? You don't get it, do you? No. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> like, tendrils, like, like the little fucking flappy things. Tentacles. tentacles. Tentacles, tentacles. Those things on the sides, yeah. Yes. I don't know what the fuck that does for the It's game, just flair for the game. I think it is, yeah. Adds a little flair. Charm. Interesting. Adds a little charm. I would honestly like if they changed the colors a little more. Damn, I don't know if you can handle it currently. Oh, yeah. Before you go making it a little more fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely don't think that I'm handling it very well. Oh my god, it's the same damn wall every time. Looks like we're gonna be here for a while, guys. I let go of A! Ah! <laughs> Get yourselves comfortable. So we just moved into, I just moved into a new place in, in Brisbane. So it's nice, I have my own keys, I have my own life. Cool. And, and soon Jamie will come and move in with us, that'll be great. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you see how much Jamie really is looking forward to it. Oh, I put all this together. Yeah, you did. Damn. Oh my god, I let go of fucking A again. Damn. I'm, you've done that a lot. I know. Maybe hold on to A. But it's like, time. it's just what... Get the fuck. <laughs> See, I remember that this time. <laughs> it's just like the instinct that, for whatever reason, I let go. There it is. There it is. Damn. It created another glow. Yes. We might get through this level yet. Now I let go of A again. You shouldn't have. <laughs> fuck, fuck off. You shouldn't have. And the one thing you've said recently is I keep letting go of A. Rhythming through this. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. The metal bug looks like he's having a good time though. Hell yeah, he is. That, oh, here we are. Here's the boss. Ooh. Is it going to be a different one? Or is it still Mr. Ugly fucking face? Maybe it's glitched out. No. Well, it could be end of the road. It's just, it's setting it, the stage, oh. Jamie. It's oh. setting the stage. Here he comes. Here comes that ugly ass mug. It, 
Oh, his spikes are getting bigger. Now he, he looks like Hellraiser now. Or did he always have spikes? Like, yeah, but like, uh, basically they were more like studs last time. Fuck, I fucked that up. Um, so he's a punk. Yeah, and then, <laughs> and then now he like, fuck, I fucked it up again. So basically, he's a, a trap punk with spikes. I wonder if he's got any um, safety pins. Oh, you know it. Safety pins. What do you think that beard punk. is made out of? Fucking just the, the pin part of safety pins. Because fuck safety. I think it's stud. Safety is not punk enough. Ooh. And safety pins aren't really safe when you're like stabbing them into yourself. Which makes them punk. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <it does. laughs> Damn, right in the mouth. Fucking, he, ain't, he ain't got shit on me. And he just needs to shut his mouth. Or you know, maybe not give me the the pathway to destroy him. <laughs> ah, I was right there. What if he bit ah. the path, and then there was nowhere else for you to go? You'd fall off to your death. But. Fucking metal bug can fight, dude. Fine. Yeah, but only for a short period. Oh, now he puts, puts shield on? Shield. Looks like Are a double serious? shield. Th triple shield. Triple shield. And I... Dang. Well, ah. we'll have to watch Raul beat this one next time, guys. Fuck you, and fuck this thing. And